I think the FG are not being serious about developing the tertiary institution in this country. The, I, I see it as a deliberate effort from the FG because of they don't really see themselves as stakeholders. The demand of ASU has been negotiated for the past four many years back, and so I think that the federal government itself they need to call ASU, look at the demands, and meet those little demands. It's as if uh, the federal government keep uh, deferring the promises they've made to ASU over the years. And this has kept uh, the repetition of the strike. And ASU will resume from one strike, and then after a while, we wait for the government to fulfill their promise, and they have to go back on another strike, waiting for the government to fulfill their promise, paying them the money they promised. And this is going to, I don't know, it's like an endless loop. And it's saying that when two elephants fight, it is the grass that suffers. So in this case, I think the students are really paying for, for this um, struggle. And another thing is the federal government, most of them, they are students, their children, their work do not stop here in Nigeria. And which is, for me, I think, doesn't really concern most of them. It's a really concerning issue because this strike has been prolonged and most of our youth, you find out that they have nothing to do and the time they supposed to have graduated so that they can face their future now it's been lingered and it's been delayed and this has not been good for our future leader. Federal government should look into the system. If they feel like what these people are asking for is more than them, at least they can also have a reasonable negotiation with them that it will be in the favor of the students and the staffs. One thing I want to even, I hope they are not even thinking that when they call on this strike that we will come and pay another school fee. We don't have the money to pay for another school fee. We will pay it already. That two months, they will pay us back. They will have to give us free lectures for two months. It's a waste of time. People are not doing any, students are at home are not doing any. So the federal government and us, I don't know, they should come to a compromise and try to figure out something. At least the federal government should try to give us some part payment or something. I don't know, anything. They should just try to come to a compromise and allow us to go back to schools. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.